Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm the Marmoset, and welcome back to Animalia and our Let's Play of City Skylines. I've been looking at our airport. We've got a metro line in. I think one of the things that I always quite like when I travel by air is the ability to get off a train and then go straight onto it. Now, at the moment, if you wanted to get to Oslot Air from another city, you'd have to arrive at our city via this our train station, cross the road, get on the subway, and travel by the subway route having with a change at this industrial point to get across to here. Whereas I'd like to make that a little easier. Now, I don't think there is enough room for an actual... Well, there potentially is a room for a train station in this area. We could do it. But we'd have to start diving the rails or raising the rails and doing all sorts of complicated things with the rails to get them to properly connect to the railway line. Whereas if we use one of Broformer's sunken stations, in this case we're going to take the brick one, and tuck it in to this gap as close as we can we can instead actually I wonder if there's a way I can get it to fit in a slightly different direction no it's not a completely sunk station so what we'll do is we'll put it in over this side and we will stick it as close as we can to there without getting rid of these dunk in there we go and then we will connect that up as such. So we've got our new railway station. And what I will probably do is actually zone these in with just tiny office spaces. So we've got that little bit. That's that in there. Do we have a bus that goes nearby? We do. Bus, bus. Bus suddenly stops here. Done. All right, you've there. Nice house, suddenly with a massive uh, railway station underneath it. So we will go back to railway line. Duck down, connect, come out. Oh, sorry. Underground, please. Space already occupied. Am I not underground enough already? Oh, yes, I need to make sure. Minus height. So that's alright. They should come out to here. Come out to there. And then have that connect up. Badly, apparently. So what it looks like we'll be deleting some of that. To the surface. There we go. And then from there. Oh, it doesn't like that, does it? Okay. Can we connect up like that? Let's just double check we've got tracks. Tracks. Full set of tracks. Full set of tracks. Good, good. A misty evening haze. Well, actually, I mean, given it's a through train, we don't actually need that bit of complication because we can just carry on from the other side. There we go. Now it's low enough. Comes out from here. Stays underground. Stays a lot underground. And then meets up over here. Right. Not entirely convinced it's the kind of networking I want. Hmm. But we'll give it a go. Let's see what it does route-wise when we take our existing train line and put an extra stop in. So the moment is doing a route where it goes from the Otterways 
to the center point to Ocelot Air, and then it goes back to the Otterways, whereas I wanted to also park up here in between. Okay. So you arrive there. So those are the end stops, and this one's in the middle. So it comes down in the center, and then it's on its way. Good, good. Okay, I'm pretty happy with that. Now, we've got a lot of metro stations that need connecting up. So let's start with Oslot Air. And let's head this way. <laughs> Immediately running into problems, because we've got some deep subterranean railway in. So let's connect. That's up to there. Yep, done. Where's our next station? Our next station is over here. Can we just go straight there? Can indeed. So we will do so. Because our railway lines don't mind sharp corners. Next stop, the feather. From the feather, we head to... Alright, that's a little absurd, so I am going to have... I am going to switch to curved roads at this point, so... Come out from here. Come out from there at a 180 degree angle. Come across... And then come around. Right, now... Now we have the fun and games. Can we connect to the Otterways under our absurd canal system? Can we get low enough? Well, let's just do a straight line. No, we cannot. We cannot connect via because of our canal system. Interest or uninteresting or ungood. Double plus hand happy. Sulkings. So we obviously want this to connect up in some way, shape or form. Now we could put a sub spur on and have it come off the Avery. So we go from here to the Avery and then dedicate a subspur. Because I don't doubt we can probably come in via the harbour and have a little sub route on for the Otterways, isolating it even more from the rest of our connections. But we've got this route here, so I'm not too fussed about that. It would be really nice if we could find a way around. I mean, maybe. You can't get through there, but maybe we can dive down on the riverbed. It's not the most efficient route in the world, but... Let's... Uh, see, we've got that canal is now in our way. Unfortunate. Righto then. Options. Well, I think moving it's probably going to be the best option. Um, if we put it on this side, then we should be able to come in and clip in. So, if we put it there, no, let's put it a bit further down. Which built a new one, didn't I? Rather than moving the old one. Okay. Is there somewhere where we think we could probably do with another an extra metro station? Where would benefit from greatly? We want one of the Avery, the tourist traps. We've got one here. Oh, the Donkey Woods. We've got an awful lot of people moving in and out of this area. It would kind of make sense to be able to stick one in. So let's grab our recently deposited metro station. And we will park one right in the middle of the Donkey Woods. There. And we'll connect you up on a dedicated little spur. Transport. Tunnels. And we'll probably work you from this direction. Because you've got to make sure I avoid Duck down onto the riverbed. Really? It's still something of a little bit of a route there. And then come up onto there. Alright, so you weave down, come around. And we're heading for the Avery next. Under the harbour. Zoom in so we can get a slightly better approach. Connect to there. Next stop. Is a pretty easy one. For our 
total tourist trap station there. Now we're heading up this way for our station on the junction. Jellyfish Horrors is next. Just think of the uh, the panel is where are we go next. Turtle tourist trap. Next stop, Jellyfish Horrors. Heading for Starfish Smile. So we will come out and around, and then finally we are going to be looping up, heading for our airport. Fortunately, this is apparently deep enough. I don't need to worry about it. Done. Connected up. Right, let's get our one direction of our circular route in. So, start at Ocelot Air. Head to the, uh, what we'll call, yeah, this is the turnpike, isn't it? Or the, the debris loader. Next is the feather. Mold circle. Otterways. Avery, Turtle Tourist Trap. We'll have to hold shift here to get it to go to the other one. Which side of the line am I on? Left hand side, okay. Turtle Tourist Trap. Jellyfish of Horrors. Starfish Smile. And then we're back round to Ocelot Air. And now we're going to do one the other way. So we need to start a new line. Can I just click to start a new line? Fine. I'll do it from here. And shift. From there. To Ocelot Air. Starfish Smile. So we've got basically just going both directions. Jellyfish Horrors. Monkey Strip, Turtle Tourist Trap, Avery, Waterways, Mole Circle, Feather, and then close the loop off back at the garage. Nice. So let's uh, grab these. So we've got three metro lines. So we'll call this, um, you know, it's the monkey line. Because it's the one that goes under the monkey strip. Spell monkey right. Can't spell monkey right. Monkey line. Leave that green. You will be red. And you will be... Uh, that'll be... Southern... Circle... Which way is the red one going? Clockwise. And I will colour you blue and you will be southern circle. Widdershins. It's very long. Um need to have a zoo name. This was Animalia. Hmm. Southern animal. Koala. Koala. Widdershins and koala. A A L A. Clockwise. Nice. So, hopefully, this should provide us with a whole load of extra mass transit options for our people. Gotta love the kink we threw out on the mole circle, just to get around to the Ottaways for dealing with the, art, the absurd canal and deep system canals we've got over here, and the various dips and bumps we've had to do to get on our existing railway lines. But overall, I think that should be a half decent connection. So, one thing we were missing was a connection here, or this bit. Now, can we drag a bus route to here? We can. Yeah, crazy. Why did you decide you want to go in a loop? Why do you not want to come round? 
Oh, because I've got bus stops here. So if I drag you over there and there, then you'll come in and go via that way. And then you'll, you just circle around and connect up to this. Good, good. Good, good, and good. I'm going to leave. Now, we've got, because we've got various routes in, technically I, what I could do is remove the bus route that comes out to Otterways and comes out to the Mole Circle. Um, or the, uh, the, connect, the bus route that connects these ones with the rest of the network. Um, that green route. I've got two routes that come into here. And then one of them comes back again. I don't think I need both of them. So more circle connect. Yeah, I wonder which line that is though. Which line is the green line? It's a dark green. Which one is it then? Bus line 22. Passengers 84. Nine vehicles. Hmm. I've already got the mole circle connect connecting you up, you up. I don't think I need that one. It doesn't go anywhere very interesting. So I've got a bus route that does connect up these ones by bus, but they're also now connected by the metro station. You've got the ability to switch lines here and here. So the only thing I really wanted to do was connect up this my industrial section up. So what we will be doing is going around from here. Plugging into that side and then probably coming up from over here. And I'm going to connect into the center one, I think. Yeah, it looks like we might want to stick a crossways station in here. Rather than have it coming at a 90 degree angle. So let's unfortunately delete that one. Yes, I know. And put that one in its place. Okay, am I going to be able to find a way of deleting that? Yes, I can. Just give me a straight line, if you please. And then connect up this one to this one. So we want Metro Route, the Monkey Line. Delete those two. Set the line mod. Have it drop. Stops there and there. Yep, okay, so that's that route connected back up again. Back and forth along there. And then we want to do a new route that goes from here to here. Back to Donkey Woods. Did I create a loop? I did. And back to there, and then we just need to go drag, drag. Shiny, you are also green. I don't wish you to green. Be sky blue. Alright, so that was nice. I really want green. You are 
donkey connects. Because you connect up with the donkeys. Right. Unpause. And let's see how much traffic, trouble, and bizarre and curious <laughs> chaos this is going to cause us. Hopefully, in the not too distant future, we will start seeing people. Ooh, hear the trains of that. Using our metro station. Yep, there's people going in it. In they go, my little sieves. Let's uh, bring up. This is the metro, wasn't it? Yeah, there's people on them. Good. Alright, that means they're working. So it means my. Oh, you can actually see them. Yeah, so there's the connection of people coming down and one getting onto both the stations. So I was concerned that this mod might, these modded stations would cause confusions or problems, but no, if you give me to zoom out of that, you can clearly see that we've got people going down onto both the sets of stations. Not how uh, easily they're wandering between them, but uh, colour coded actually, the people who are trying to get on which train. So yeah, looks like we've got. 31 people per week, only a tourist at a time, several boats, not that many using our things, but we've got an awful lot of people on our buses. That should, over the time as things tick over, see an awful lot more people getting on our metro station and getting stuck in and going interesting places. Good. All right. Thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. This has been an episode about laying metro lines. Now have a nice loop that goes all the way around both directions. We've got a kind of a short cutty route across the Donkey Woods to connect to our major industrial area in the heart of our city. We've got a spinal route connecting up both sides of this. This route will obviously probably carry on and go through into the next area of our city. Thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. I have been the Marmoset. This has been City Skylines, a let's play of. Please remember to like and subscribe.